life is always going to present you with challenges and difficult situations, but you always have to view every situation or challenge in a positive light and realize that it's going to make you into a stronger and better person. I always felt like I was like that kid, like, oh, who's that bald kid, you know? Like, I don't know, I always felt like there was always like a microscope on me, because I mean, I'm very recognizable. Like, you're gonna, you're gonna recognize me over other people just because of the way I look. Yeah, when I first met Sam, I f was freaked out, dude. <laughs> I didn't know who he was, though. And he just stands up and he's like, yo, my name is Sam Lennonbury, but you can call me Burr. Everyone like was like, wow, he's the man. <laughs> when you meet him, Obviously, you're gonna recognize him by the way that he looks, but you remember him because of the dude that he is and the way that he acts. I think that's the cool part about that kid. Yeah, Bert. Oh, I want to be on TV though. Yeah, you gotta be on TV. Yeah. 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 But like I, I realize that like people are always like looking at me and like they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna recognize me. I went to my first day of school, my senior year. There was like a really, like, it was like a pretty noticeable um, bald spot. I started like wearing a hat to school. And then one day I was like, you know what? Like, I can't just keep like hiding this anymore. Like, I'm just gonna shave my head. And so I went um, to the barber shop with my mom. And um, it was a pretty scary day. And like, I, I was just really nervous. And then I just shaved my head. But then I realized that I had a really good shaped head, which is a good thing. I was like, all right, I'm gonna be fine. I'm gonna be good. That was like an accepting part, but like once I was actually bald, like I was like nervous because like, I mean, you want to like be like a good, look, attractive person. Like you want, you want like, I wanted girls to like me and stuff. Appearance isn't everything, but when you lose your hair, whether you're a guy or a girl, that's just a big switch up from what you're used to. I started working out like real hard. I got a personal trainer. And I was like, look, like if I'm gonna be bald, I'm gonna have to get jacked. I'm gonna have to like hit the gym. Like I gotta do something. It took a little time to become more comfortable with myself. It, like it took a while to get there. Cause I just thought that everybody was always staring at me, and I felt like everybody knew, and like they thought that like I had something like I mean I had a disease. I thought like everyone was like, oh, who's this weird disease kid? You know. People would just like assume that oh, someone that's bald has cancer, but in this situation, it's different. start and I outline each eyebrow. You want to get like a nice little arc. I've gotten pretty artistic since I've started doing this. When something like that happens to you, it really tests your characteristics and like your perseverance. I don't think there's anyone else in the world who can like make alopecia like the thing that makes everyone remember them and like he rocks it it's amazing and i respect him for it when i did have hair i always had really nice eyebrows which is the main reason why i draw them on Voila. Voilà.